I'm here with Axel Bowman. How are you doing, man? Hey, I'm good. I'm very good. Yeah. You are headlining the Trick Stage at our Found Festival. Are you looking forward to that? Have you got anyone else on the lineup you want to see? Oof, yeah, it's going to be super fun. Man, I love L London. It's amazing for a Swedish boy to come and experience like a big city. No, no yeah, I'm super excited to see uh, Floating Points. I was excited to see Session Victim, but I saw them just now and it was brilliant. And yeah, and then I'm just super excited to hang out with yeah my friends like Maya Jane Coles and and the Hypercolor crew and 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 Hassel Time and y you know this I don't know man. Uh, you had an EP out two months ago, two or three months ago, on Hypercolor called Black Magic Bowman. Are you a master of the dark arts? <laughs> yeah, I, I am. Yeah? yeah, yeah. I come from a long family, a long tradition of, of black magic. In, uh, yeah. in the north of Sweden, my mother was, a, she was a referred to as, not a witch, but we call it a hexa in Swedish. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So she knows, uh, she, she knows, yeah. What have you got coming up for the label this year? Because you've already had two or three releases out. Uh, we have uh, oof, we have this great thing, th this treasure of a um, this gold mine of music called Lukas Nystrand. He's already been featured on James Holden's a mix that James Holden did once. He was featured on, but he's released shitloads of music on his own kind of underground labels. But it's also so we, we get to pick and choose from his vast catalog of music, and we put together an EP that is just sublime. After that, we have uh, yeah my album. We have uh, an EP by Pedro Dollar, Peter. Uh, EP by Kornil Kovac. EP by Baba Stilts, a new genius, young genius from Sweden. We have, uh, yeah, there's plenty of coming, plenty of stuff coming. Whose comeback were you more excited for this year, David Bowie or DJ Kotze? Hey, Kotze, hey, Kot yeah, totally. <laughs> One thing I liked a lot uh, with Amigdala was you could really feel Kotsi's kind of personality and his kind of eccentric humour. That's something that you put into your music as well. When you go into the studio, do you sit down and think, I'm going to show a bit of the Axel Goman humour in my music? I don't know, maybe for me, like the, the euphoria and, uh, and, uh, and, and laughter is, is very much connected. And I have, I have a hard time distinguish what, is, what comes, off, comes off as funny and what comes off as just being beautiful. You know, I don't know. It's, it's, uh, yeah. Thanks a lot for speaking to us. You've got to give out your set in a minute. Last question. Uh, on that EP you released earlier in the year, you had a track called Klinsman. Do you reckon there's going to be a track called Klopp in a few years? The better Jürgen. Oof, that is a really good question. Well, maybe I'll name one track Ibrahimovic. I would make one track Ibrahim for sure. A trip. Maybe I would make five tracks. Different Ibrahimovic tracks. Maybe I'll make a whole album. Di Tribute to Slatan Ibrahimovic, my favorite player in the whole world. Got that exclusive on camera. Cheers, man. Thanks a lot, too. Cheers.